Francis in the building. What's good? Kareem, Madonna, what's good? What's good, sister? Fresh you know, off a flight. Here. I know, but don't be up for my sister. You know I got to represent. I want to nothing down for you know, I'm so happy that um, you came to town because, girl, it was a whole rainstorm going on, and then you came to the city. You and came I back the, home. I bought the heat. Yes. I, I you brought everybody. the sun out. I bought it. I did. I bought it straight <laughs> from Miami with me. I bought the heat, y'all. I did. I definitely appreciate that. So, yeah, you well, shining. Too. You blinging. I I'm see you, chilling, sis. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. Don't do me, sis. Don't do me. <laughs> y'all, Shanique is not going to let y'all know, but we got a real relationship. And a right real now, I'm trying to keep a real per- professional. Uh-huh. Her, you know? Because she's just got to get a queen and do her job. And look, but, yeah. I'm, I'm extra trying to keep a professional over here. <laughs> so, you know, Pre, she got it, of course been doing the the waist trainer thing for years i mean very oh, man, successful you know a, a real million dollar ticket out here in these streets you know <laughs> you live a very fabulous life you got your husband three beautiful kids you got your prima donna cooks cookbook my recipe um bible i'm sorry my pressure cooker my seasons my waist trainers my nutritional supplements yes ma'am and baby products on the way that's right and what help us is i'm like since i'm opening up a, a spot she like wait hold on i got some things that you can have hey sure, can hold on i'm gonna pull up and she pulling up anywhere okay i am pop in the trunk i'm going to the kids football games and she <laughs> popping and she like yeah sis i got this in there and, and, and this will look real good your place and so i thank you so much because outside of this industry you know this business like right. we are real like you know friends i Absolutely. i definitely appreciate you we we had a bond and we connected i mean we went to see gregory <laughs> rp to him and that was a good bond for me and shot like you know you my dog shanika you know you my sis like that's fam y'all anything shanika needs she know she could get right here for me so don't even try to play <laughs> don't play with her you already know so you know i said all of the the things that i said to get to because you've been doing the music for um for a while now and you know you always have something catchy these could never I love that. that is my joint. Okay, it's the truth, and you know that. Like and that's that song is. I like you know. I like to make my music just like my life, empowering women. So when you go in the shower, when you go out, when you just chilling, when you vibing, you just gotta know. Can't nobody mess with you. Right. I don't care who they is, how they is. You gotta know. You can never. That's right. Ever. And so, <laughs> speaking of that, there is, um, you know, a woman, Jocelyn Hernandez, Brooklyn, the Puerto Rican peasant. Oh, and I'm just like, out of all people, like, why wouldn't you try to be, like, in alliance with a boss like Pre? You know what I'm saying? Bosses see bosses, but you you want to single out her because she's a successful woman without, you know, a TV show, without any of this Without stuff. a pimp. See, here's the deal with a uh, pimp. The, yeah, here's the deal with the Puerto Rican peasant. She sees something that she wants in life, and she doesn't know how to attain it. So her whole defense, since she was 14 years old, out on the street, she just know that she has to beef and fight, and she doesn't know how to come at people. And that's all I know from her character is just that she's just a hater. And it's so sad because a hater don't know that they're a hater. But I'm going to let her know, and I'm going to help her with this mental problem because this hater shit got to stop this year. It's 2020. <laughs> and you got to tell me you lie. <laughs> yeah, we lie. Uh, oh, Lord. You already know. No, no, no. But we're going to help her with this hater mentality, and we're going to help her get better by herself because at the end of the day, any t- anybody that hates you or concerns and put all their energy and time and effort into you hates themselves. Right. Because I don't take it personally because she doesn't know me personally. Right. So it's not personal to me. And I have been around you for years now, and I've never heard you down anybody. I, I haven't. Like, I know that you've had, you know, people have came for you on um, on the Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. Absolutely. You know, and and that's separate from, like, you know, coming for you and your character and somebody just kind of, like, targeting you. But I've never heard you go in on anybody. Like, because you want to keep it have, cool. I don't have the need because what that, what me... Me talking about you or me trying to call out your flaws doesn't give me anything. I don't gain from it. So why am I putting my energy and effort into something that I can't even 
cash out on. At the end of the day, I put my energy, time, and effort into something that is going to give me some coin. That's right. A transaction, the check will be clear. Exactly. The bank will be straight. I don't have time to hate. Hate is like, listen, I leave the drama to karma, period. That's just how it goes. But one thing about it is people see you and, and you're successful and they think, oh, pre-love the Lord, pre-love a kid, she love a husband. Yeah, and I also love revenge and I also not you know love getting back at people so don't try me because it just may be the day or it just may be the year that I'm just on some let me play right this ain't a bench season for me I want to get in the game and play so if you want to play with me let's go let's ball I'm gonna win a championship so let's do it I'm off the bench this year last year I was on my Oprah this year I'm on my pre what's up that's right hey, and I'm gonna still get my check you know I don't really know this pre <laughs> Um, I think she might be around for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> she is here for a minute because at the end of the day, I got a daughter right now. I ain't, this my baby. My daughter's eight months years old, and I'm using it as an example because what happens is when you're so nice to people, a bully especially, everybody is a bully until you get a, and meet a bully. All I know about the Puerto Rican peasant, everybody who she's went to war with did not want to fight back with her. You're right. And she is a bully. You like to bully people. You like to call people out on the things that you're insecure about yourself for. And they just let it slide. Mm -hmm. Even the dangerous and trifling and tasteless stuff she said about her own baby father. You're right. The alleged abuse claims to their daughter. I won't even speak the treacherous and the, the low down how person she is, but... I'm going to do this for everybody she bother. I'm going to get her for the old and the new. Since you want to come mess with this person, yes. and you call me the little piggy, I'm glad you know that. Because guess what? This little piggy ain't go to the market. This little piggy coming to your front door. And I will huff and I will puff and I'm going to blow it down. So thank you, Puerto Rican peasant. Let's roll. It's Hot Water 7 now. <laughs>